What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to LEGO Minifigure of the Day. Today we'll be taking a look at green farmer overalls with lime short bill hat. This guy came out in one set back in 2012. Guys, it's always nice to see some blue collar representation from LEGO. <laughs> um, all jokes aside, um, this minifigure is okay. Um, it's from 2012, so, you know, we're well into the years of good leg printing at that point. So it's a little weird to see a guy wearing overalls, uh, and he just has no pockets. You know what I mean? Um, and I understand this was, this was definitely a cheaper minifigure. Um, it came out in, like, a, uh, a brick box, I think is what Bricklink calls them. You know, one of those things where it's just a box full of bricks, and usually they... They throw in, like, one minifigure in there. Um, they've been doing that for a long time. Uh, but still, um, I, I think that the torso prints great. It's both front and back. Um, I like the red arms um, and how they, you know, continue the, the color of the shirt. You know, they, they could have given them short sleeves, but uh, I feel like as a farmer, I think by 2012 they had dual-molded arms, at least. Um... But, you know, it's nice. It's just a nice look for a farmer. You know, the red and the green. Um, the lime green hat is also a pretty cool addition. I feel like you don't see that color a lot. Um, I could be wrong, but, you know, I, I looked on Bricklink and I only saw maybe 20 minifigures that had it. Um, and I also found out while I was on there, apparently a, a minifigure hasn't come with a, a standard hat like this in almost five years, six years, which is crazy to me. But, uh, yeah, I, I, it might say something when I'm talking more about the, the parts of the minifigure than the minifigure itself. Um, this guy's really cheap on Bricklink. Uh, his average use price is like $1.30. Um, so extremely cheap. Uh, I really wish they would have given this guy some leg printing. Uh, to me, he's only... He's like a 6.5 out of 10. Um, he's a very, very, very average minifigure. I mean, there's no arm printing, no leg printing. The torso printing, I think, is really good, and the hat, but, I mean, besides that, it's an extremely generic face. Uh, really not too much to say about this guy. Like I said, I think that some extra printing and maybe some dual-molded legs could have really saved him. So, yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you all tomorrow. Represent.